But I just finished my other, watching my other video and realized that I didn't feature this product all that much. I kind of, it was the first one I did and I just turned it over. The other ones I kind of moved around quite a bit. So in the interest of just, I don't know, featuring all the products, I wanted to show you this one again here. Um, so you get a good sense of what it's like. So this is the lock and lock 7.4 quart that has this little handle that allows you to kind of pull it out from a cabinet or somewhere else. So it seems fairly liquid tight. I did hear a small drip. Oh, I saw it. So there's some sort of small drip here. But in comparison to most of the other containers that were leaking quite a bit, this is not severe at all. I'm going to fill it up with more water just so we can see. This is like, this is a little weird. This hinge here, this lock, I hope you can see it, yeah. Doesn't seem to quite go all the way. I'm not sure why that is. So if there's a leak, it might be because of this. Um, so that's weird. Yep, I mean, this is pretty liquid tight. It, if if it's not entirely liquid tight, it's very, very close. And I'm not even sure I can state for certainty whether, I'm not sure I'd feel comfortable saying it's not liquid tight. I'm not sure what the small leak I saw was. It could have just been, I don't know, water on the lid or something. I mean, that's that's pretty good I think um, okay now we'll try the OXO just because I filled this one up with more water and let's see how the OXO fares okay so we'll fill this up with more water Quite a bit. Um, the other containers, maybe I don't know. the lock and lock I just tested is pretty full, or maybe a quarter of the way full. This is maybe about the same. I don't really see any real signs of leaking here. There's a small water drop here, but that may just be because... Well, I'm also shaking it a lot. I can see that the lid is kind of coming off. If I keep this up, I'm worried the lid might just fall off entirely. But, I mean, hopefully you're not storing your lids up, or your whole container is upside down, suspended from the air. Um, I feel pretty confident with both these containers that if they're used in a normal fashion um, that they're going to be very close, if not entirely, uh, liquid type.